The process is first deciding what style of guitar I want to make, and then picking the wood that would go with that style. If I'm doing it by hand, start making up the, the jigs to, to cut the wood out. And then if I'm using the, the CNC machine, I'll uh, start making the program to cut the wood out. All that stuff is just the roughing out. Once the guitar is roughed out, then the handwork starts. I take it from the raw wood to the roughing to the finish work. All the little accents and whatnot. To make an average electric resonator guitar, that would be a solid body resonator guitar. It takes about 60 hours, and that's from raw start to finish. And then to make an acoustic guitar, it's definitely averages about 220 hours. A lot more time goes into an acoustic guitar just because there's just a lot more that needs to be done in order to make it sound good and to set it up properly. There's things that once it's done to an acoustic, there's no turning back to where when you're working with a solid body resonator guitar, there's a lot of adjustment that can be made throughout the whole process. There's a metal cone in a resonator guitar, and the metal cone acts as a speaker, and it gives a resonance of a sound to amplify the strings that go over the bridge. And that style of instrument leads to a unique sound. To me, it evokes an old-timey, early Americana sound that you might have heard old recordings of uh, Robert Johnson or whoever. And that sound is what I'm always kind of shooting for.